She was lonely, abandoned, and forgotten. Recently, I found a new saint whose name was Saint Laura Montoya. She's from Colombia, and she actually had like a really terrible childhood. She was lonely, abandoned, and forgotten. When she was just two years old, her dad died, super sad, and her mom really didn't want to keep her around, so she sent her off to her grandma, and then her grandma didn't want her around, and so she got sent to an orphanage. Talk about super sad. You're in an orphanage when your mom's still living and you have grandparents still living. She must have felt totally neglected and ignored and just very sad. However, through all this, she continued to know that Jesus Christ loved her, even despite of all this crazy garbage in her family, parents who were not being good role models for her, grandparents who failed in their responsibilities. But she did not fail in her responsibility. She was faithful to the Lord. She was inspired to live differently, to not follow in the bad example of her parents, but to live something new, something courageous, something bold. And the way that she did that was by becoming a religious sister. She became a nun. Uh, she became a missionary sister, in fact. And she went into the, the forest, into the wilderness of Colombia to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ and his salvation from sin to the natives that were there. Uh, talk about an awesome person. And she did this. This was her life's work. If you find that you might also have parents that are not inspiring, and if you feel ignored and forgotten and neglected by them, be not afraid. Be of good courage. You don't have to follow in their example. Just like St. Laura taught us, if you keep your eyes on Christ, if you put your hands up to Him and put your life into His hands, He will protect you, guide you, and inspire you with a true mission that only God can give, with a true purpose in life. You can rise above the family problems of your past and truly become a living saint and then a saint in heaven. This is Father Sean O'Brien from the Catholic Church, bringing you the fullness of truth and love. Please God. God bless you all.